young people may be on the launch pad of a stellar career in the space industry. Supervised by some of Europe's top rocket scientists, Alejandra and the other 22 students from eight different countries simulate every aspect of a rocket campaign, including the launch itself. It all happens during one week of intensive teamwork at the Space Summer Camp on a little island just north of the Arctic Circle. I like all the things related with the space, but especially the physics related with the space. I'm interested in natural science and physics, and I'm also good interested in astrophysics and mathematics and I, I like playing cricket. I find the whole idea and the whole concept of being able to go hundreds of kilometers into space above the atmosphere and even further, I, I find that amazing. On the small island of Andoya is the campus of the world's northernmost permanent rocket launch facility. The European Space Camp takes full advantage of all the expertise Norwegian and European space research and technology has to offer. And thanks to its Arctic location, the station is also a key centre for research on the Northern Lights. A volunteer team of former ESC participants, all presently students in science and technology, is in charge of planning and organising the camp. We know that the camp has been successful when participants tell us that they had the best week of their lives. And hopefully some of them have been inspired to pursue a career within science and technology. To ensure the most inspiring mix of science and fun, Team Space Camp also organises various social activities. The most spectacular event, though, is intended to be the rocket launch. Working in groups, the students cover the whole launch process, sharing information and experience. They replicate all the roles and tasks of a real rocket launch, supervised by experts from the industry. Finally, the big moment arrives. Just go inside yeah. and come out. You can't see it very clearly now, but launch from around there and it'll go boom, like okay. that. Sure. Three, two, one. Delay. Delay. But due to a technical problem, it's more of a damn squib than a trailblazer. Okay. Space is hard, but we get there. Well, when, is the <laughs> when do we get there? <laughs> Not exactly rocket science, but a valuable and rewarding experience nonetheless.